tutorial on guys, I'm going to be showing you an easy glitch where you can get into the Kyle Perico Island in free mode. And I apologise for not uploading, but I am going to start uploading again. I just took a short break, but you can get into this island. I am on free mode right now. And you can fully explore the island as much as you want. You can stay here as long as you want because you do actually, you're in free mode. As you can see, I just got that job invite as well. But you are in free mode. And you're on the KO Pericot Island. You can stay here as long as you want. You can do whatever you want. And it is a really easy glitch. It's not com it's not complicated. It's not confusing. It's really easy to do. And I will just show you and explain it to you the easiest way you can do, even though it is pretty much easy. And you can even explore the whole place. Just do feel free to do whatever you want. Because even though this map should be in free mode, but for some reason Rockstar didn't allow that, so we have to do a glitch to get there instead. But anyway, to start it off, you're going to go into your submarine, and then you're going to go up to the board, you're going to hit right D-pad, you're going to hit gather intel, just the very first mission, and you're just going to accept it. Now, once you've hit accept, all you want to do is just go to your helicopter, or just do whatever you need to do so you can get over to the airport. I'm going to just go over to my helicopter, just to make it quicker. So I'm just going to go and get into my helicopter, and then go over to the airport location, so you can go ahead and get started with the glitch. Yeah, if you've got any video ideas as well, like anything you want to see me uploading, just comment down below. But anyway, without further ado, let me just quickly fast forward this part. Alright, so now, when you get to the location, you're going to go to the yellow marker. And if you don't already know, that once you do go here, there's going to be a plane that does take you over there. I'm going to quickly skip that, so the video's not too long. And then once you get over there, you're going to drive with some guy. And you're just going to get taken to the main place where the dance floor is. And I'll quickly fast forward this part as well. Alright, now this is where the trick actually begins. So when you start off here, you don't want to go to the left. You don't want to go to the left. You want to go to the right or just straight ahead, okay? Do not go left. You want to go towards the yellow point that says exit by the south gate without being spotted. Okay, you just want to make it all the way up into this gate. Also, a really important part is you need to count how many times that you do get detected. Because I will explain how we do it. Uh, so once you've come out, what you want to do now is just get yourself caught. Alright, so you can either get caught by a vehicle, guards walking past, or the cameras. Just It doesn't really matter what you do. Just what you need to do is just purposely get yourself caught. So all you have to do is just run up to a guard, run up to the cameras, run up to a vehicle, and you will get yourself caught. So as you can see, I get spotted. It says in the bottom left, you are caught by a security guard. Each time you get caught, just remember and count up. So I've just been caught once. Now what will happen is a message will pop up saying if you keep doing it, you will be sent back to Los Santos. But the actual amount of times that you can get caught before sent back is five. So as soon as you get caught five times, you're automatically getting sent back to the island. So what you guys want to do is you want to get caught four times. You want to get yourself caught four times and return to this point four times. Now, once you have been caught four times, what you're going to do is run out into the middle of the road. And once you're in the middle of the road, you're going to pull up your phone. You're going to go to the sites of your app. And once you're on the sites of your app, what will happen is when you pull up your map on GTA, the cameras and the guards are going to stay in the same position. But the vehicles will still be driving around. As you can see, if I pause now, the vehicles still move, but the cameras don't. It's just the vehicle that moves. So what you're going to do is you're just going to keep the map open. And then you want to pay attention to when a vehicle is coming closer to you. Which I'll quickly just skip to that part now. Alright, so now as you can see on my map, a vehicle is just approaching me. And as you know, vehicles get you caught. So I'm just about to get caught for the fifth time, which would normally send you back to the island. Once you get caught, pull out your map, you will be parachuting. And then you will land on the island. And now you're in free mode on the island. As easy as that. If you did enjoy, make sure to leave a like on the video. And comment down below. And if you are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe for future videos. Thanks for watching.